All right, folks, we're doing it. We're finishing this baby up here. We've got one leg. We need eight. All right, so uh, four per side, two sides. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to make a linear pattern of this part. That's why it's important that it's a separate part. All right, linear pattern is here. Entities to pattern, well, part two is our entity. Direction. So you just need to pick a line that's going in the direction you want. So we want it to go this away, that away. Uh, it's putting it one inch away. We know that's wrong. And how many do we want? We want four. Enter. Now notice it put four of them going that way. That is not right. So let's double click our pattern. Let's flip the direction because they got to go that way. And we need much closer spacing. These need to be 0.1 inches apart, a tenth of an inch for them to fit in our breadboard. There you go. Now, if we look at it from the side here, you will see that uh, by some miraculous math, we ended up perfectly on the edge, uh, but we need it to be centered. So the pattern is good, but the position of this leg needs to be moved. Remember, we put a dimension between this sketch and this side, and lo and behold, this is perfectly flush. So we need to take this existing dimension and divide it by two. That'll pull everything over. So let's see, leg profile. 0 0.06 needs to be 0 0.03. No, uh, it doesn't have to be 0 0.03. We need to take, oh, okay. Uh, well, okay, it's 0 0.06. The midpoint of this is 0 0.06 from here. The midpoint of this is 0 0.30. So that means this is 0 0.30. So we need to move it half of that over. So we need to take 06 minus 015.045. There we go. Take 15 off of 06. Now, it's perfection. There we go. Guys, looking good. Now we got to use the mirror tool to plop them over on this side. Now the mirror works on... Um, Entities to mirror, it's part two, three, four, and five. And it needs a plane. It needs a plane. So P for planes, turn our planes back on. And the reason we did this in the center here is because we have a plane indeed. Perfectly centered plane. And now you see that those legs just came back perfectly. Okay. Notice that when we made that mirror copy, we added it, so we want to take new. We're going to end up with nine parts now. What? It's okay. Uh, it looks better when they're separate color, when they're gray. Turn the planes off. Now let's take our uh, this part. Let's change the color back. Let's go to a nice dark gray. Don't go black, or you lose all the you lose all the definition. So dark gray is fine. And go even a little bit lighter. There you go, folks. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Now, one thing I want to I want to double check here. I noticed in the other class, for this to fit in the breadboard right, the bottoms of the legs need to be 030 apart. So that might be an issue. So I'm going to go to my leg path here. Hmm. And we need the distance from here to here to be half of 030. So that's got to be 0.15. Now, it's not going to let us because we've got this, this angle calling the shots. So if we delete this angle there, it will let us. It will pull it more straight, which actually looks better. Now we accept that. Now the leg's rebuilt. Now we know it will fit right down into our breadboard. Okay, so that's actually better for our um, project here, okay? You wanna put letters in the top like I did, Shift S, Sketch, N for normal. Here's the letter tool, draw a little box and put your awesome letters in, okay? Uh, dip, dual inline package, dip eight. 
enter or accept it there it is and you can D for dimension this box to set the size 049 is too big how about 0 0.025 uh, that's too small 0.25 you can go bigger, 0.3 maybe. That's good. Escape, drag it into position. Or edit text. This is actually a 555, five, five, so let's use that. That's a better, and that fits better too. Booyah. Drag it so it's centered up. Extrude, remove. Just go a hair. These are etched in with a laser. They're not deep at all. There you go. Love it. Love this chip. All right, good luck. Get it assembled. Okay? Have a great day. See ya.